Right now, police are sifting through a mountain of goods that are confiscated from a store in Mission. If the business owner is accused of selling counterfeit goods. Police arrested uh, the person at her store, Sue's Accessories. The 65-year-old is accused of possessing and selling designer counterfeit merchandise, something that surprised neighboring business owners. 41 Action News reporter Alyssa Donovan has been uh, following this case and has more. All day, members of the DA's office and Johnson County Sheriff's Department boxed up items at Sue's Accessories on Johnson Drive. I'm, I'm really surprised because for as, as long as she's been here, I, you know, it really is surprising. Sandy Russell says Sue's Accessories moved in about a year or so after she opened her coffee shop, and it hasn't been here very long. Probably three or four years, maybe. Russell says the owner, Sue One Pack, was always very friendly and fit in with the rest of the businesses on the block. Oh, Sue, we call her Susie Q. She's, she is a character, just a, a real spitfire. Russell visited her store and didn't think anything was off about the merchandise. I've been in their store once and I bought some sunglasses. I really, I didn't even think twice about it. The DA's office says the items they're looking at include purses, wallets, and jewelry. After seeing the boxes and what was packed up, other business owners say they had a hunch, but declined going on camera, telling 41 Action News they didn't want to speak negatively about Sue. That was Alyssa Donovan reporting. Investigators will likely be on the scene for a few days collecting items, and if convicted, she could face the uh, Sue on Pock, could face hefty fines or even jail time. And the webpage for Sue's accessories say that she's been in Kansas City for more than 30 years. And it also says she's had shops in the River Market on Rainbow Avenue and at 47th and Mission. She was also featured on Mission's Mission Forward website in 2014.